what's going on guys in this video we are going to see how to navigate and work with files in linux system now let's go ahead and see an example first i'm going to see the directories details of the directories to do uh, find out the details of the directories ls so you can see the details of the directory i'm in right now and the next is to change the directory you can always type cd cd is to change the directory and if you want to move to desktop just type desktop over here and it's going to move to desktop okay now we are in a desktop now to see what directory we are in pwd it's going to show you the directory we are in right now and uh, so back to to change back to home you have to just type cd it's going to change back to home now we are not in the desktop we have we have gone to home so when you type pwd this is to check the directory you will see we are in home now grass we are not in desktop now to move back to desktop we just have to type cd desktop again cd desktop desktop okay now we move to des desktop now here we are going to see how to create folders and uh, and also you can uh, there's one more thing to back directory like cd dot dot it it goes back to the previous one it doesn't matter where you have been it cd okay let's see cd space dot dot yeah cd space dot dot it will go back to the previous directory it doesn't matter home or whatever you are in it go back to the previous one okay now i want to go to the desktop cd desktop now here we are going to see how to create folders how to create files and how to delete files and also how to delete folders and how to move folders how to move files into the folders and also how to change the name of the folders now let's uh, see one by one first i'm going to see uh, we are going to see how to create a new folder to create a new folder we have to type mkdir this is to make directory that's what mkdir mean it will create a new folder so to let's name a new folder as let's call this one some name let's say bike bike is my new folder so it's going to be created on desktop because whatever the directory you are in that's that's where the folder is going to be created so mkdir bike we created a folder name bike now let's create another folder let's say mkdir plane so plane the another folder plane is created now i want to delete a folder to delete a folder rm rm is to remove so rm dir dir let's remove the plane folder so p l a n e the plane folder is removed from the desktop now to create a file we have to put touch t o c h touch and uh, let's create the file as plane so here we have created a file name plane now to delete delete the file again uh, let's create one more one more file touch uh, bike as well bike so i create one more file to delete the file again we can use the remove rm but here we don't have to put dir because this is not a folder to remove the file just have to type rm and type bike it's going to remove the file okay now if you want to copy something else copy a file you can always uh, copy using this one like cp let's say i want to copy this file we created plain and i want to create another file name plain2 so copy plain and plain2 you will create the same file name uh, with another one plain2 and if you want to move a file to a folder this is how you do just type mv that's to move and we have a folder name bike i put that one move a file okay which file which file we have a file name plain so plain is a file 
plane move plane and uh, which folder we have a folder named bike so i want to move this one to the bike folder and what you want to move again plane and that's it so it's going to be moved in bike now if you open bike folder you will see plane over there <coughs> same as that you can move story like you can rename the file using this move so mv <coughs> We have plane to file, so I'm going to <coughs> rename this one as another one. Let's say plane to plane to, and I'm going to call it coffee. Coffee, we already have it. Let's put uh, apple. So you can see, oh, uh, you can see the same file created as apple right here. And those are the basic things, basic things uh, navigating and working with files. I hope you guys find this video helpful. Thanks for watching. And if you are trying to learn Linux, there are a bunch of videos, uh, videos uh, coming up. And also don't forget to watch them. Don't forget to subscribe to this channel. See you next time.